Hi, in this video I will show you how you can use your gamepad or joypad as a remote control. Uh, here you can see an option uh, to use the joystick, gamepad, joypad as a remote control uh, when you are not in full screen applications. And it's optimized for the Xbox uh, 360 gamepad. And uh, you can see it's not for full screen because uh, in full screen games you might want to use it. So uh, it's disabled there. Uh, the actions I, I do here now are all performed with this uh, gamepad, so you can see how it, uh, that it's working. And I will now talk a bit about the key uh, usage, what each key does. So the A key is uh, mapped to the uh, left mouse button, while uh, the B key is mapped to the right one. Yeah, uh, the X key is the middle mouse button, uh, you don't see it here, but it's uh, there. And the Y key is uh, simply the enter button. So I can press enter now, or this key here, or yeah. And I control the mouse with the left uh, joystick, and with the second joystick on the right, I can uh, scroll to the left and to the right. And with the digital pad, I can uh, simulate the arrow keys, so I can go up and down and left and right. Here, I can go left and right too. Okay, okay, and then uh, if you are a bit further away from the screen, you might want to use the zoom function, uh, which you can trigger with, uh, with the shoulder buttons. Uh, with the right one, you zoom in, and with the left one, you zoom out again. So this makes it easy to read something. Okay, then there are the back and the start button. Uh, the start button performs uh, like a play pause button in media players. It simply presses the space key. This works in, say, the video LAN client or media player, or media player classic and similar. And uh, the back button uh, is for Explorer, it uh, just uh, makes uh, the Explorer go upwards. So I press it and I get up. Yeah. 